Here to help us plan for that is our resident Christmas tree expert, Mr. Jimmy Alexander himself. Well, Joe, I hope you and your family has had a very happy and fun Thanksgiving. But now that the turkey is gone, the pies are finished, <laughs> and that annoying family member is finally out of your house. <laughs> And you know who you are. It's time to make a very important holiday purchase. So why don't we head up to Germantown, Maryland, where generations of people from the DMV have found the perfect Christmas tree. Here in Germantown at Butler's Orchard is one of the few places where you and your family can come out with a saw and cut your own Christmas tree down. But look at Daddy. <laughs> so what made you guys want to come out here and do this today? Uh, it was a different experience, and we love a live tree, so we just wanted to come out. It's a gorgeous day. Have our kids experience something new this Christmas. You got to yeah. pick and pull. Now, I think you were smart parents that I see how you got the work done here. Yeah, they wanted the tree, right? <laughs> Teamwork makes the dream work. You're like the, you're like the Grinch's dog, Max, in this. <laughs> So who better to tell you how to pick out the perfect Christmas tree than someone who's been doing it since 1981? First and foremost, look at it. Do you like it? Does your whole family like it? Um, that's number one. Number two, is it going to fit in your house or your apartment, wherever you're going to put it? Um, obviously, when you get the, these trees inside, they get a lot bigger. Um, and number three is just, just the freshness of the tree. And you can tell that by pulling, pulling this one and you get... I have, I pulled one needle off, so that's a very fresh tree. Am I wrong, sir, that no matter what your sons or you decide that you want, somebody is making the final decision, am I right? On everything. She makes the decision <laughs> on everything. So this is just one of many things she makes all the decisions on, and we love her for it. And it's been a tradition in our family for almost 20 years. And what kind of tree are you looking for? I just love something I can just, like, really hug, just like a big bear. <laughs> Well, I think we need to see the hug. Can we see the hug? Gotta see the hug. Absolutely. <laughs> winner, winner. What kind of tree are you hoping to get? This one. <laughs> <laughs> I think he made it easy for the whole family. Is this the one that you want? Yeah. Yeah. Why do you like it? Is it because you just want to go play? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta love it. And I didn't realize, I mean, you would think that going out to like a tree farm would be something you'd have to drive hundreds of miles away for. Not it's at in all. Germantown. Not at all. It's they, in the Burbs. Uh, uh, Butler's Orchard's been there since 1950. My question for you, sir, is if you have ever cut down a Christmas tree. Yeah, actually from there, many years ago, it was quite traumatic. I, I was there and uh, I got it, put it on the roof, and at the time, my girlfriend, she, when she drove into the garage, it hit the top of the garage and broke in two. And it was so traumatic, let's just put it this way. Now, I have a husband. <laughs> really hurt me right here. I can't get over it. Uh, Jimmy Alexander, live TV. Anything could happen. Anything could happen indeed. Happy holidays. That's, the, that's a love story you can only get right here on <laughs> <laughs> these TVs now, folks. <laughs>